Oh, hi. Welcome to the Brew Review. This is the segment where we are reviewing board game beers. Now, we like to think of these as good beers to drink while playing a board game with your friend at the pub. I enjoy to play uh, board games at the pub. It's a nice social setting. You can invite people to come and go, and it's good to have a game that lasts about a beer. It's good to have a beer that lasts about a game. So today we've chosen for you Zombie Monkey. Zombie Monkey is, as Tall Grass Brewing out of Manhattan, Kansas calls it, a robust porter. This is a dark beer, which has a really, really nice pour. You can see I already did one for you before uh, you showed up. I knew you were coming. Uh, good frothy head on it. A lot of carbonation, but not too much so. I didn't over pour. And uh, it smells a bit like uh, coffee with a little bit of a caramel or vanilla in it. And uh, now we're going to see how it tastes. It's definitely a good porter. It's got some uh, some alcohol in it, so it's a robust porter. It's about six and a half percent, and you get a lot of caramel out of it. You get a lot of, uh, like I said, vanilla, and uh, that coffee is certainly flavor flavor is cer still certainly in there. Um, and uh, I think that this would be an excellent beer to go with any board game, especially one that lasts about a beer length. So when you're out at the pub playing your favorite board game. Go ahead and get a get yourself a zombie monkey porter. Uh, on a scale of zero to ten, I think I'd give this one a pretty solid seven. Uh, I'm not going to go drive to the ends of the for, ends of the earth for it, but I would uh, certainly not ever pass it up if it was offered. So I think seven is a pretty appropriate number. So that uh, that's it for this episode of the Brew View. If uh, you guys want to see some more of this stuff, definitely comment below. Let us know if you liked it, and uh, see you next time. Cheers.